I am Anil Kumar. Welcome to my YouTube channel and the website Global Map Institute. In this video, we are going to compare the numbers with exponents. Now, this is a very important question from examination point of view. Now, one of the students have asked this question on my channel also. So, the question here is, which is greater, 7 to the power of 8 or 9 to the power of 6? Let me write. You are comparing the numbers, 7 to the power of 8 and 9 to the power of 6. We need to also understand, how do we explain our answer? Interesting. I'd like you to pause the video, answer the question, and then look into my suggestions. Like always, this summer also, we are offering many courses for students to register and get ready for September. Send an email on the address given and achieve success. Now, let us see the solution of the question. Okay, so now let us try to analyze the situation. How do you compare the numbers with exponents? Well, the strategy is simple. The strategy is to either make the base same or to make exponent same. Or same exponent. Now, in this question, you see that both the powers are even, and therefore it is easier to make same exponents. So that's the hint, right? Now, with this hint, I'd like you to pause the video and answer the question. I hope you got it. Let us look at this. We have 7 to the power of 8 and we could write this as what? We can write 7 to the power of 4 whole square. And on the other side, we have 9 to the power of 6. It can be written as 9 to the power of 3 whole square. So now you have the same exponent. If the base is bigger, in that case, the number is greater. Perfect. Now you know what is 7 to the power of 4. It may be difficult for you to calculate. Let us understand the strategy to calculate that also. So we could think like this, 7 square square, right? Which is 49 square. I'm just trying to show you a strategy, right? 7 square is 49, you remember. 49 square means 50 minus 1 whole square, right? So, without calculator, you can easily do these calculations. Now, 50 minus whole square is 50 square minus 2 times 50 times 1 plus 1, correct? 50 square, you know, is easy. 2500 and minus 100, correct, and then plus 1. So, you know, 7 to the power of 4 is basically 2401 whole square. And 9 cube, 9 cube is also known to you. 9 cube, you know, 9 square times 9, which is 81 times 9. 9 times 1 is 9. 9 times 8 is 72. I'm just showing this calculation. Most of you will know it. So, it is 729 whole square. Now, it is very easy to figure out, correct? Which base is greater? Clearly, 2401, right? And so, we know the solution now, which is 7 to the power of 8 is far greater than 9 to the power of 6. I hope these steps and the strategies which you have used in this video will help you to solve similar test questions. Make sense? Well, 
in case you want to learn from me, you can always send an email on the address given. Feel free to write your comments, share your views, and if you like and subscribe to my videos, that will be great. Thank you. We regularly register students for our courses. This summer, we have a very special program. You can send an email on the address highlighted and join the program of your interest. That will help you to perform much, much better in the coming semester. Register by sending the email as the seats are limited. Join Anil Kumar classes and get ready for a bright future. Thank you.